Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. My name is Chelsea if you're new here, if you're not new. Hi, welcome back. How are ya? Hope you're having a great day. Follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is at I am C C Suarez. I am that across all social media. I'm much more active on Instagram though than other socials. Let's go ahead and jump into this video because it is about Modere. I haven't talked about Modere much. They suck. They really suck. They really do try to hide the fact that they are a multi-level marketing company. We are going to watch an opportunity call and debunk every freaking sentence. It is gonna be awful. I've already watched one to say like 20 minutes of this video no probably like 15 and it's pretty horrendous i did speed it up a little bit just because they talk so slowly and i wanted to smash my head through that window so let's go ahead and go over a few quick little tidbits first started in 2013 you won't find any mention of modere like prior to that however it was a different company. It was called New Ways. And that company had to rebrand or rather shut down and just completely start again as Modere due to a lot of different reasons. It still is, but it was essentially a pyramid scheme. And they were heavily, heavily pushing recruiting, as is every multi-level marketing company, pushing that and a required auto ship for consultants, which almost every multi-level marketing company has that. But essentially it was more so, okay, it has to be like you have to buy it instead of, you know, either you buying it or selling that amount. So they had to rebrand essentially because of that. And then also tax evasion, things like that. So now Modere sells clean products, health and wellness products. I hate it. You've most likely seen their Modere trim. They're like pudding essentially is what it is. So you've seen it. You've seen it. You've seen them on TikTok, Instagram with their magic spoon and they'll sit there and hold Hold the bottle the wrong way purposely and go like this and just do it and then do you want to lose 70 million pounds strictly out of your stomach by just eating pudding every day yeah bitch i'd love to go get me a snack pack but that's not what this is so it does not matter what you say the facts stand you can have a difference of opinion that's fine but this is not a difference of opinion it's a difference of reality modere is in my opinion and from everything i've seen is a multi-level marketing company operating as a pyramid scheme now people all over tiktok have been like it is it's dual marketing it's social selling it's social retail they have two sides to it you can hit the top of the compensation plan just by selling no you can't absolutely not so we're gonna go over a bunch of that today and i just wanted to mention those few things like i said they really try to hide the fact that they are a multi-level marketing company they are two years ago i want to say when i say 2020 they had a very, very, very heavy push on influencers. So big Instagram influencers, IG bloggers, like the lifestyle ones, Christian Vordy style, whatever her last name is. And hmm. I'm motherfucker, shut up. Champagne and Chanel and like that whole group of people on Instagram. Laura Beverlin, cannot stand that one. But all of those people, mostly every one of them, were doing these types of like Instagram ads for Modare or they are like involved in it somehow. It's very confusing and it's not straightforward or transparent at all, which influencer marketing has to be. There are certain things in place that you have to do and those people weren't doing it. They weren't saying if it was an ad, which half of them never do, which is infuriating. It is a multi-level marketing company. It does not matter what someone in the company says. It is an MLM and we're about to go over this call and it's going to be very frustrating, but it's fine. Just about the products, because I know this is going to be more about like the opportunity, but I do just want to say you're not going to lose weight by eating this liquid collagen pudding, any of the fill, like pills, the probiotics, the shakes, the anything like that. You're not going to lose weight by doing that. Get in a calorie deficit, move your body, get a thing, track your movement, your calories, go work out, okay? Take your measurements. Don't focus on the scale. That makes so many people get discouraged. Fuck the scale. She a dirty slut. Focus on your measurements. I literally wrote mine down this morning and I'm very excited about it. I mainly wrote them down so that I could order something from Skims because I'm terrified that I'm going to get like the wrong size and stuff because the sizing on that website is fucking weird. Please understand that whether it's ketones or herbal life or any of these products, it is not going to help you or cause you to lose weight. At the most, they suppress your appetite, which is not good, and they give you a little boost of energy 
and they make you poop. Again, not good. Like it's essentially a skinny tea. Don't do that, okay? All right, let's go ahead and do this. All right, big welcome to everybody. Thank you so much for jumping on tonight. And uh, we're just excited that uh, we have the opportunity to share a little of our story. You're gonna get to hear from some different speakers tonight, but uh, you are evaluating an incredible business opportunity tonight. So our goal is to quickly move through some slides, share um, just what Modere is all about. And uh, I thought we could start off with uh, a little of our story so you know who's speaking to you guys tonight. So yes. so I am Kristen Kemper. This is my husband, Jordan Kemper. And this is our daughter, Kinley, on the screen. She is our world. Um, but we have been in network marketing for quite a few years. And um, it's been such a blessing to our family. But um, a year ago, we found ourselves in a place to where we just felt a little burnt out by the industry. Um, it was such a blessing in so many ways, but there were just a lot of things that we just didn't love and just it didn't sit right with us. And um, when we came across Modere and what you're going to hear about tonight, we feel like it changed all the parts of network marketing. It removed the parts we didn't like. Um, it, and then it kept the parts that we did like, and then it added things that we never even thought were possible and hasn't been possible in this industry until now. Um, so we have been with Modere for, I think we just did our 11th month, and it has just been so life-changing for us. And um, just to see what it has done for the people on our team, not only financially, but relation, relationally, um, and just how fulfilled we are right now has just been so special. Um, so we're excited to share this with you guys tonight. So Let's jump right into five reasons why we chose Modare. And as you're evaluating this opportunity for you and for your family, these are really the highlighted points that I think really separated it for us. Proven systems, award-winning products, next level leadership, a disruptive model and timing. And we'll touch on each of these tonight. So let's start by telling what social retail is all about. Okay, so we're going to get into the nitty gritty details, but really when it comes down to it, the way that social retail works is we send you exactly what to post so that you don't have to come up with something on your own. It sounds like they've been in network marketing forever and they're acting like this is so revolutionary, so different. It's just more of the same. And that's something that actually a lot of y'all had talked about when I did that video on the girl move going from Monate, right? Yeah, Monate to the impact project, Q Sciences, and just talking about how she's almost self-aware. She almost, you can tell she is so close to understanding, wow, it's not just the MLM I was with, it's all of them. It's not just that one company. They're all run the same. They're all structured the same. There might be little things different. The verbiage might be a little bit different. Vernacular might be a little bit different. It's all the same. You know, you think that this can work and that this is the only way. And that's one of one of the issues with the industry in general. But yeah, that sounds miserable. I don't like that. I think I already said it, but I did speed this up just a little bit because they were talking so slow. Now they keep calling it social retail. It's still the same thing. I don't care if you call it something different. I don't care if you call it influencer marketing or affiliate marketing. It's the same thing. I don't care if you call it multi-level marketing or network marketing or a direct sales, social retail or social selling. It's the same thing. They are like your boss essentially, or you're on their team or like you get the guidance because as an, inf an influencer, you typically make all that shit yourself. A lot of times though, the company will have like things that you can share or like post yourself or if it's like a full on campaign, they'll have that too. So they're acting like it's so revolutionary, but it's like, no, this is a affiliate marketing. Now, okay, so they send you exactly what to post. Great. They should do that anyways. The MLM does that. <laughs> it's not revolutionary. And then I'm getting paid twice daily. How many of my friends have to buy something for me to one, even get paid for me to make my money back and for me to get like get paid twice a day? It's very vague. It doesn't really make much sense. Off discount code with friends. So you're giving benefit and then you get paid twice daily for all the referrals that you bring to the company. So it is 2022 um, and you're going to hear a lot about what Modare is tonight, but I think it's also important to note some of the things that we aren't because I know that sometimes this industry can get a bad rap. Um, so we are not going to have you be awkwardly approaching your friends and family and getting rejected. We do not promote any type of cold messaging or weird hey girl messages. We don't do that here. Um, we are not going to ask you to post about a company all day, every day and be spammy. And we also don't do any home parties or local hotel meetings. No home parties or local hotel meetings. Cool. Great. It's not the 80s. I would fucking hope not. The internet's been invented. First three go hand in hand and it completely contradicts the slide before, right? Before it said, share your $10 off discount code with friends. But the thing is, you're just sharing it there. You don't have to buy it. You know how many of my like affiliate marketing sales and commissions actually come from family and friends and people I actually know? Oh, hardly any of them. Most of them come from my subscribers because I have built up an audience 
a following. That's the only way you're going to make money and be successful with affiliate marketing. But then it says that you don't have to awkwardly approach friends and family slash get rejected. Okay, so what are you doing then? You're just posting about it. But if you're not posting about it a lot, people aren't going to see it, want to buy it or do anything like that. So are you posting about a company all day or about a product all day or not? And then, okay, no weird hey girl messages. That's gross, don't do that. However, on the flip side of that, maybe it's not a cold message. Maybe it's a warm message. Maybe it's not the first message, but it's the fifth. It's the 14th. It's the 30th. It's after you've become internet friends with them, essentially. Would you rather have that? And then you get hit with that message, which by that time you already know they're in it. So would you rather be hit with that message and then be thinking, damn, they were in it for the long con. Like, damn, they really spent all this time with this intention in mind just to sell me this or sign me up. Or would you rather them not waste your time and your feelings and just have them get it out of the way and be like, here's my intention. I want you to sign up for this. This is what I do. Put in the comments below. What would you rather have? So one thing that I thought was really helpful is, you know, a lot of people, especially probably those of you that are participating on this, on this Zoom call have probably participated or someone in your family has participated in some traditional direct selling company or MLM. And so when we use the term social retail, I think it's helpful to kind of understand the difference between the two. So these are just some of the highlighted differences, but within traditional direct sales, you have to recruit and build a team to make money. Here with social retail, you can build a solid income just through customer acquisition. In fact, seven of 10 actually prefer not to recruit and team build. No, in, in an MLM, you, you can make money from just selling a product. Is it going to be a viable source of income? And are you going to be able to reach the heights of whatever was promoted and that lifestyle that was promoted by the person who recruited you? Probably not. If you're just trying to get people to sell the product, what is this call for? If it was truly just affiliate marketing, you wouldn't have to do all this. It also wouldn't make sense because you wouldn't be oversaturating your own market. All right, so traditional direct sales, you have to recruit and build a team to make money. Yes, but you can make a little bit of money by just selling the product too, because otherwise that's just a legit pyramid scheme. So are y'all insinuating that multi-level marketing companies are pyramid schemes? Because if so, you work for an MLM. And then social retail, you can build a solid income through selling. No, you can't. Of course, a solid income is going to be different from ev for everyone, but it, what they are, let's just focus on what they're presenting right now. In my opinion, what they're presenting is a full-time income, part-time income, thousands of dollars a month from just selling the product. No, you can't. Self-consumption model, vast majority of the volume sold to distributors instead of sales to customers. It's so amazing that they are making really great points when it comes to multi-level marketing companies because they're a multi-level marketing company. Social selling, social retail, it does not exist. It's just a term that they made up to try to separate themselves from MLMs. This is amazing. <laughs> they're doing my work for me. Vast majority of the volume driven by customers who enjoy the products and come back for more. Where your sources for that because no every mlm can just say that but typically unless you're a publicly traded company you don't have to make that type of information public and you can just say whatever you want inflated prices to offer distributors wholesale price and then it says social retail though same price for customers and social marketers so why would you sign up as a social marketer this means that they can't use the excuse of oh our income disclosure statement's so messed up and looks so bad because people sign up for the discount. Well, according to this, there's no discount to sign up for. So if you want to make it so that MLMs have to provide that information to distributors or potential distributors before they sign up, meaning to the public, go to www.mlmchange.org and find out how you can be a part of making it so the FTC requires that of MLMs. Someone asked me before, why do we have to tell the FTC how to do their job? Because the FTC isn't big, it's small. They're doing a lot. So therefore we have to also help. I think this one's 2019, but this is from financeguy.net. Love that guy, such a good resource. So this says that 31% of the company is at the very bottom. And that's of active social retailers. Yeah, 66.6% .6 of people making less than $320 a year. Most likely not making a profit at all. So un unless you're going to hassle your family and friends and recruit all them, but they say that you don't with social retail. So wait, recognition titles primarily from team building. 
And then social retail side, recognition for sales achievements as well as team building. I'm pretty sure most MLMs do recognize people that have like the most personal volume or like the most group volume. Pretty sure they do that. Also, why the fuck does that matter? No customer referral award. And then with social retail, award for a customer referral, 35% of our customers come through the referral model. Okay, here's the thing though. They can try to use like all different types of words, but they're saying no customer referral award. Money, you get commission. Same with an MLM. If they are buying it through your landing page, through you in general, you're gonna get money for it. That's commission. You have to do that, right? That's it's, you like the, what? So they're saying that you don't get that? We're only three minutes into this call. So I wanted you guys to see a couple of examples of individuals that have been following our systems and our strategies. We provide 120 days worth of text campaigns, meaning we're, we're helping you with what to post on your socials. Again, you can add your personality to the system, but these are some examples of individuals that have been following the systems and are seeing quick results. This is Danielle. In her first month with Modere, she acquired 23 customers. She had over 3,000 points in sales and earned a 30% commission. This is Julio Cesar. Julio had over 110 customers in his first month did over 14,000 points in sales and earned a 36% commission. And Julie, uh, she had over 20 customers, 2,000 customer points in sales, earned a 22% commission. And then you can see here on the right, 30 customers. They can't make it easy for us, can they? What's a point? You're, you're just not gonna explain that? Modere Movers is a point earning system that rewards a social marketer for growing their Modere business. Social marketers earn Modere Mover points by enrolling and or selling products to new customers or social marketers. Why are you selling products to other social marketers? Oh, it's because when your downline buys something, you get credit for it. Got it. Okay, so definitely not like, not like a pyramid scheme at all. Got it. Okay. And like, this is an opportunity call and they haven't explained any of it. Good God. Okay, activity points, customer points. I found it. Ew, it's called CP. Points from products purchased by customers in a social marketers pod. Okay, so like your VIP customers, I assume. I feel bad for anyone who joins this company. That is not easy to understand. And I'm a very intelligent woman. Multi-level marketing companies, we've said it many times, make it so hard to understand so that it confuses you so that you're, you just trust your upline. And you're like, oh, okay, I guess you just got to recruit. 30 customers, 3,100 customer points earned a 30% commission. So what I love about this is you've got different people with different backgrounds following the same system that are seeing high levels of success. And I thought what would be kind of a, a cool opportunity for you guys this evening is to hear from some individuals that have been with us that are actually implementing the systems. And so I'm going to stop sharing my screen here and I'm going to introduce you guys to our first guest. And let me go ahead and bring on Liza Henley. So Liza, you there, girl? Hi, I'm here. I'm here. Girl, why don't you share your story? Oh my gosh. Well, thank you. I talk really, really fast guys. So if you can just like listen a little bit quicker, that would help me out a lot. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I am not new to the industry. I'll be honest. I've been in the industry for 11 years. And so a lot of times you hear people that speak who've been in this industry for 11 years and have had like cool success. Oh my God. Their lean body system, the Modair trim, the like one of their most popular products is $159. And then just one bottle is $100. Okay. Okay. So 110 customers, if we're thinking that the average purchase is like a hundred dollars ish then that's eleven thousand dollars in sales each month that's not profit that's just off of the sales and 36 percent commission on that is three thousand nine hundred and sixty so let's just say around four thousand dollars so let's say around four thousand dollars that's before you've purchased any of your own products and then that's also before taxes and you don't have insurance or any benefits at all. Realistically, depending on what state you're in, but let's give them the benefit of the doubt. And of course, this is all speculation and you know, math, I'm just going off of, off of like the averages and shit like that. That's a lot of product to sell in one month. That's crazy, that's not sustainable at all. After like taxes and everything, that's probably only like 2,500 a month. And again, that's not counting the products that you purchase yourself. And then also I would be very interested to see how many of those people have a big team under them. Like who are you actually selling the product to? Are all these customer points based on your downline or is it from your actual retail customers? Stop sharing my screen here and I'm going to introduce you guys to our first guest. And let me go ahead and bring on Liza Henley. So Liza, you there girl? Hi, I'm here, I'm here. Girl, why don't you share your story? 
Oh my gosh. Well, thank you. Don't call her a girl. Also, I love Utah. I think it's beautiful. I lived there for a year. No offense to anyone who's Mormon. Lots of Mormon people are not necessarily in a cult. Depends on how you practice and what you believe. These people, all these people look extra Mormon to me. I talk really, really fast, guys. So if you can just like listen a little bit quicker, that would help me out a lot. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I am not new to the industry. I'll be honest. I've been in the industry for 11 years. And so a lot of times you hear people that speak who've been in this industry for 11 years and have had like cool success. I didn't. Um, but I loved the industry. I really believed in the model. I really believed in the method. And I saw other people winning. I just wasn't. And it wasn't for a lack of trying because like I was trying. I was working my butt off. I was working my tail off. I've been on Instagram and social media for a long time. And so I was kind of ready to hang up my hat. And then I saw social retail. I saw what Modere had to offer. I saw the products. I saw the people were like, it's the same thing. Stop calling it something different. It's not different. I mean, hey, maybe they get more money for like actually selling a product, but it's the same as all the other MLMs. <laughs> also, fun fact, Jessie Lee Ward was in this MLM. Yes, she was. She was fired from this one, as was her direct downline reaching for them all over the place i saw that i wanted them and so i thought you know what let me give it let me give it another shot and so in the last eight months it sounds so dramatic to say that my life has been literally flipped upside down in the best way possible i'm, I'm seeing success here that i've i've seen for years with other people that i thought like wow that's literally so cool and i'm like, gonna cheer you on and i'm gonna be your cheerleader i just will never get it i'm having that now and not only am i having it but even better than that, I have a team of people who are winning. I have a team of people who are actually earning and, and, and allocating things for their goals. You mean you're making money now because people in your downline are making money? Wild. What a wild concept. It's almost like if they weren't making money and if they weren't recruiting people or rather without a team, you wouldn't be able to make money. That's so interesting. Yeah, I've been doing this for 11 years and you know, and then they just say all this like crazy shit and it's like, have did you ever think that it's the industry and you should get out of it? Just imagine how much time people have wasted. Can't put that shit on a resume. And if you do, that's embarrassing. Don't do that. And their desires and the things that they want. And so it is like the, <laughs> the craziest thing ever. And I feel like now I know for a fact, I knew that other people could do it, but I couldn't do it. And now that I know that I'm doing it, I know for a fact anybody can do this. And so it's uh, it's been a long, beautiful, crazy, fast eight months. Not everyone can do network marketing and not everyone should. Thanks for coming to my TED talk. But one of y'all mentioned in one of my last videos, you were like, it's so weird how they just keep saying, we wanna see people win. We moved to this other company because we saw people winning. And it's like, how vague is that? Why don't you just say, I saw more people making money and it looked like more of a viable opportunity instead of, we saw people thriving and winning and oh, we're winning. It's so, it's just so immature. Does it, am I being an ass or does it seem immature to say stuff like that? I love it. Thank you for sharing, Liza. We love you and you're just such a blessing to everybody on our team. So thank you for sharing with all of us. Um, the next person that we are going to chat with is Sarah Sullivan. She is a mama of a little boy and she is a mama to be right now to another little boy. We're so excited for her. Um, and so Sarah, will you tell us a little bit about your time at Modere so far? Of course. First off, everyone, like I should not be here because I have zero experience at all. Um, I hopped on, what is it like five months ago now? Um, I'm actually a special needs teacher and I am a health nut. And so that's the whole reason I'm here and I'm driven by passion. So I found these products, tried them for like two weeks. And then I messaged Madison and was like, all right, send me the thing. I think I want to share this with my friends because I already was. Um, and so I was like, I might as well make some money, but I'm never going to be like that girl who's like posting on Instagram. I'm not really going to lean in and like meet people because like, I don't know, it's just we Like I was totally against all of this. So if any of you have reservations, like, hello. I feel like if you were actually against it, you wouldn't have even tried it. I just can't stand when they're like, I was the biggest hater. If you have any reservation, no, you weren't because you tried the products. So you weren't against it. You were for it. Poster child for that, I promise. Um, here I am five months in. I actually was able to turn a profit my very first month after. And I talked to my, I was even nervous to bring this up to my husband. I was like, so like, I'm kind of thinking about this, but like, I don't know. It's like weird. I don't know. And he was like, try it. Why not? You know? And I was like, oh, are you sure? Like, I kind of thought he was going to be like, no, I He said, yes. I said, yes. I jumped in and somehow I'm viewed as a leader on this team. And I say that not to like toot my own horn, but to say like, truly it's possible for anyone, zero experience over here. Um, so once I started, I was like, I just want to make enough to be able to afford my products. Right. Because my husband's in dental school. I actually just quit my job. I was at a job that I did not like at all. 
And I was like, if I tell my husband, I'm going to be spending this a month, he's going to be like, with what money? Because he's in school. <laughs> so I joined, I quickly was able to pay enough for my products within like the first, I don't know, two, three weeks, which was insane. And then I was like, wait, like something went off in me. And I was like, wait, this could actually be a thing. I don't like my job. What if I like bust my butt and I work hard enough so I could quit my job. And I was like, okay, maybe in like eight or nine months or so, I was able to quit my job after four months um, of being here. And I get to stay at home with my baby and I did not miss him. And this sounds so cliche, but I did not miss him learn to crawl. I did not miss him learn to take steps because I was able to be here. And if I weren't, he would have been at a daycare and I would have gotten it on a note sent home from the teacher. You know what I'm saying? Um, so like that in and of itself is insane. On top of that, you guys, I want you to ask yourself this and I actually posted this on my Instagram today, but I mean it so wholeheartedly. I think that God works in like the craziest, mysterious ways. Damn, she's using all of the manipulation, you know, shaming moms for working to take care of their child. It's interesting that they are having people who have been doing this for eight months, five months, whatever, but also teachers need to be paid more. Let's say that first. But secondly, like they're not saying how many people you, they recruited. They're not saying how big of a team they have. You are not selling these products and just selling the products. All of these people have te like teams under them. All of these people have ranked up. All these people are making money from a team below them. You are not quitting your job just doing the affiliate marketing part of it. You're not doing that. No. If I said no to this, five months ago, I think of the people and the stories of health that I have helped bring people to that wouldn't have been there, right? Like my dad, okay? So my dad, for instance, has had joint pain in his knees for years, like painful, painful. When he wakes up in the morning, he's in pain. He has to stretch him out and he's like an old man making the noises, you know, and all the things. He now has zero joint pain. Like, because I showed him these products, because I said yes to this thing five months, like it's like all of these things follow the bouncing ball, right? My mom plays golf all day long outside. She has a lot of skin damage. Her skin looks like 10 years reverse now. And she's like more confident than ever. I don't know if that's a good thing or not, but she is, she's got the confidence coming out the pores now. Um, so I, I just want, I just want you guys to say, it's not a cure all. You could just take normal generic joint medicine and take care of your body or change up your skincare routine to something that is made for people who have more damage or who are out in the sun a bunch could also wear a hat while you go golfing or tennis or whatever she said could also just wear some fucking spf too this isn't the only option and it's frustrating when they make it sound like that so essentially if you're not if you're saying no to this your dad's loud knees cracking is your fault it is your mom's under eyes you're responsible for that. Who you could change lives for because that's that's why I don't feel uncomfortable like selling things because I'm in my mind, I'm not. In my mind, like I am so confidently stepping out in boldness and saying like, you need these products because I actually mean it. It's not, I always say you're not selling a used vacuum, right? Like these are products that actually change people's lives. Like we have a little girl that, um, sorry, I know I'm talking about, I'm just spewing my passion. Um, but there was a little girl who posted the other day, her mom did. And truly, like, it could bring me to tears just because of my special needs background. Like, I just know what a lot of kids go through and they have to do it, honestly, a lot of times in the darkness and quiet. Um, this little girl had, like, crazy um, skin, some sort of skin disease on her whole body, like, flaky red patches all over her body. And I just kept thinking of being her mom and being like, they've tried everything. There's nothing that the doctors have given her, every medication, you name it they try our collagen and her skin is like completely transformed. And this little girl is able to go to school and not be made fun of and not have to itch her flaky skin and like all these things. Can you like, can you not make these claims? This pudding in a bottle they got with their magic spoons, it really just is a cure-all. I mean, I've really everyone in an MLM when they are just talking about one product that's annoying. I swear by and love, this is liquid gold. Their serum, oh my God, it's so good. However, I'm not just talking about that. That'd be annoying. If I was just talking about one product all the time and one one like one thing on social media all the time, I show y'all wig them, I troll stuff, I do little movie reviews like on my Instagram too. But it's just, oh, it's, it's just, it's putting yourself in such a little box and it's not a fun box to be in. It's a small one that smells bad. And I love telling people about them. And this platform is incredible. You will meet people that you will literally be friends with forever. Um, I just got off of a retreat with a couple of these girls and we had the time of our lives. You won't be friends forever. I'm only to the 11 a.m. mark and I have to get down here. After you leave the company, nine times out of 10, you're gonna get blocked and it's really upsetting. But hey, it's a cult. 
God is not in your Zoom call, Jessica. I don't know if that's her name. She looks like a Jessica though, right? The sad thing is, is that they said her name and I already forgot because I don't care because <laughs> it's not about her. It's about what she's saying in this culture, in this environment, in this scam. You talk, I'm like, just keep talking. I love it. Um, all right, so we are gonna keep moving on here and share a little bit more about this business with you guys. So you heard Sarah talk a little bit about our products and how incredible they are, how they work. Um, this is just a small little overview sampling of some of our products. We have 4 million customers worldwide in our first seven years of business. We have 90 plus clean living products in a broad range of categories. We have a lot of third-party validation, including EWG verified, EPA, and NSF certified. We have the number one collagen product in the world with seven international patents and 36 human clinicals. And we also have an award-winning weight management. The number one collagen product in the world. According to verywellhealth.com, Best overall, vital protein collagen peptides, Besha, the Besha powder, natural force marine, whatever, ancient nutrition, true nature, <sighs> CB supplements. Guess what's not on here? Modere. Let's look at Vogue.co.uk. Best collagen supplements to try now. Vitaglo Original N, Vital Proteins, Dose & Co. All of those are still the top. And guess again, what's not on there? Now Forbes, that is a pretty legit one. Vital Proteins, again, the top one. I saw a Cosmo one and an L Magazine one where, again, Vital Proteins was the top one. You know, let's go to Healthline. What do you know? Care of and Vital Proteins. You know what's not mentioned at all on any of the, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven websites that I just looked on? Modere. Just because you say you're the best doesn't mean you're the best. Just like Jessie Lee Ward saying that she's the number one network marketer in the world when she's clearly fucking not. I think she's listening to us because she took that out of her bio, I believe. Someone sent that to me and they were like, she took it out. And I was like, oh shit. So it's funny that <laughs> like we're seeing certain things change. But yeah, just because you say it's true doesn't mean it's true. So something I want to point out too with all these products that you're seeing here is that they are consumables. And the reason that that is important is because when something is consumable, it allows you to get paid more than once for an initial effort. And a lot of these products are in 30 day supplies. So when people run out, let's talk about something being consumable. Consumable means you consume it. You have to buy it again, like most of our products, meaning you're going to come back. You're going to be a repeat customer, typically. That doesn't mean it's good. <laughs> it doesn't mean that people are going to buy it over and over and over again. Multi-level marketing companies could make if their products were actually sold in stores, like in reputable, like Target and shit like that. And in retail stores, you could make a lot of money. You know who's not going to make a lot of money by doing that? The reps. Who's their main customer base? The reps. That's why they're not going to do it. One of the many reasons. Also, most retailers would not want that in their stores. 30 day supplies. So when people run out and they have a good experience, they naturally want to order more. So I love that there's awards and recognition. And a lot of times when you see awards given to a network marketing company, it's within the direct sales space. These awards that you see here are actually neutral awards. Uh, the Frost and Sullivan the best anti-aging products, uh, the best weight management supplement. You can see there in the lower right-hand corner, that's our trim product. I just love that Modere continues to be recognized nationally. Why don't you I'll, I'll talk about this. I get so excited about the biocell. All right, so this is our number one award-winning um, liquid collagen. This is our liquid biocell. So what is really cool about this product is with a lot of products, there is no proof that they work, right? People just kind of make claims and you have to dance around the fact of like what they might do with this product, because we have human clinicals, because we have the patents, we can just flat out say what it does and what it's proven to do. So it improves joint mobility and lubrication. It reduces joint discomfort. It promotes healthy cartilage and connective tissue. It decreases skin dryness. It restores youthful glowing skin. Um, it increases your skin collagen content and it improves skin microcirculation. So what the biocell does is it actually increases is both your collagen and your hyaluronic acid by 6,000% in 28 days. So when I first started Modere, I didn't fully understand hyaluronic acid. So hyaluronic acid is the lubrication in your body. It's the lubrication of your joints. It's why my two-year-old has really plump 
cheeks with not a wrinkle in sight and they're just so full and so hydrated and that's not the case once you reach 30. It's actually not the case once you reach around like 21 because that's when our bodies stop creating their own collagen and stop creating like new collagen which is honestly really fucked up and I'm not saying that this doesn't work but also you know what what also works taking care of your skin and your body you know it, it just seems weird that it's like well now I just have to take this for the rest of my life this is just, it's just a part of getting older, like, and yes, I get Botox when I get it once, but also who the fuck cares? But still, like, I just can't see in the fact when they're like, are you getting wrinkles? It's your whatever, whatever. And it's like, yeah, we're getting older. That's what happens. That's normal. Aging is normal. We don't need to look like we're 20 when we're 60. Take care of your skin. With both collagen and hyaluronic acid as you start to pass your 20s because it just steadily starts to decline. And that's why we wrinkle and why we age. So here are just some examples of people who've been taking our liquid biocell. You can see the skin, um, the skin results. And then hair is definitely a big, a big thing that specifically women really, really love. So I'll talk about the uh, axis line. So axis, if you think about it, there's a lot of talk about the gut health. Yeah. And when the gut isn't operating efficiently or it's damaged, there's a lot of different things that can stem from that, certain autoimmune issues, et cetera. So I love the axis line because they've got some great products, including the trebiotic. And the trebiotic is the only three-in-one formula. It's got pre, pro, and postbiotic, really good for the gut and the microbiome. And then we've got a, a gold's product, a green's product, and a red's. There's a lot of other like normal like probiotic stuff. You don't have to take this type this type of stuff. You could just eat better and talk to your doctor and work out. You could do that. Like I understand we all need a little kick, a little bit extra. All right, sometimes I take some some vitamins and stuff. You know, a few times a week and I do stuff. That's okay, but it's bullshit. Good for the gut and the microbiome. And then we've got. A, a gold's product, a green's product, and a red's product. And I like to mix all three of these together in one. It's like tasting the rainbow. But the greens is great for alkalizing and our bodies heal in an alkaline state. Uh, the gold's great for inflammation, great for digestive and joint pain. Um, and then the reds. Sir, are you tasting colors? Woo! I just tried to drink out of this and my straw wasn't even up. For inflammation, great for digestive and joint pain. Um, and then the reds um, are great for heart health. And so all three of these are great options. What I love too that Modere does is they not only make like high quality products that work, they actually make them enjoyable to take. So there's been plenty of products that I've come across the years where I'm like, I hate taking this and I'm just so much less consistent. And then I don't necessarily see the results with these products. They actually taste good. So it becomes so much easier to create that habit, not only for yourself, but for your customers. You could have just said what you said at the end is that it tastes good. It's just like gummies. Like I'm more inclined to take my favorite vitamins, like my goalie ones or the, what's the other one? Like na nature's valley, something like that. Like those ones, I'm more inclined to take it when it's just in gummy form and it tastes good and I can just eat it real quick instead of like swallowing all these pills or taking like a shot of something. But to phrase it, like it's just so much more enjoyable. Like I enjoy taking it. Like fl it's not new. Flintstone vitamins. Do you not remember those? I'll take the skincare. <laughs> So this is the next generation of clean beauty. This is our cell proof line. It is scientifically formulated with potent and award-winning ingredients. It reduces the look of wrinkles and improves uneven skin tone and it visibly enhances firmness. What I love about these products is that it is, you can see a difference with some of these in literal minutes. You know what else does that? Like all those Olay products. Listen, sometimes they are expensive, sometimes. And then like the Estee Lauder ones too. Sometimes that's just expensive. Those like serums and shit, but they work. Day or two of using them, sometimes, yes, you can see a difference. But you know what's insane? Is that those products are probably cheaper than this, which is crazy. Publications that put MLM products in there, a lot of the time it's paid for. Or one of the writers or someone is associated with the MLM. And then I have even had it confirmed to me that a certain publication put Monate, a Monate product in one of their like best of lists and they got destroyed it was not received well and that writer got fired because they were associated with the mlm the only reason they put it in there was because that and one of the links that they put in there went back to their own like their own thing and you can't do that 
and it was not disclosed or anything like that which is real fucked up like there was like a general disclaimer but like you can't do that pretty sure it specifically says in your contract with the publication that you can't do that anyways just a little tidbit for you that i thought was interesting is really great when you're sharing on socials about it because you can literally show it work right before your eyes and then your customers have a great experience i know um the um the eye cream is a favorite like your dark circles start to disappear within minutes it really tightens those crow's feet around your eyes and then i will also mention our body firming foam this stuff is wild you know that like crepey skin that sometimes you get under here or other places it just like smooths out dimpled cellulite or crepey skin and it just gives it that smooth appearance my mom jokes that she wants to like bathe in a giant tub of it um i don't know how they do it but that stuff is absolutely amazing i'll just love it and i'll add to it when you think about this from a business perspective not a consumer perspective when you have seven international patents on a product and you've got uh white papers clinical trials the the matrix of our collagen and hyaluronic acid that combination right there is what gives us the competitive advantage and so you'll actually see those that matrix being infused into a lot of the different product lines that we have but nobody can replicate that combination. And I really believe from a business perspective, that's what gives us the competitive advantage because literally no one in the marketplace has what we has or can compete with us with that collagen technology. No one can compete with us and no one's better than us except for all of these other products that are listed as number one in multiple publications and we're not anywhere near it. So interesting, my guy, cool. Global leader in clean clean living products, 320% in business over the last year. What the fuck does that mean? Obviously, you're going to grow more when your job and how you're paid is to recruit people. Fastest growing female-led company. Oh, the CEO is a woman. That is rare. That is very, very rare. She's be- absolutely beautiful, by the way, too. Not that that matters. CEO recognized by Forbes for changing the health and beauty industry. On the future of e-commerce in the golden era of clean health, wellness, and beauty. In this interview, can you explain why you initially chose to market your products directly rather than through retail channels? And she said, back in 2008, I was launching a t- new technology, what? A new technology in nutrition, an emerging category for which there was little consumer awareness, if any. I believe then, as I do now, that speaking directly to your consumer is the best and truest way to tell your story and communicate benefits for novel concepts. That sounds like a whole lot of nothing. By educating people, you have more control of your story and can build a more authentic relationship with your customer. You're able to control the narrative and control the education and speak directly with your customers through social media. You can educate them through social media. If you are instead just educating your social marketers, your retailers or your whoever, your distributors, if you're focused on educating them or whatever and they are promoting it and selling it for you, that's just a middleman. Again, you're not getting rid of the middleman. So that's really that's really strange and I don't like that. They're making it seem like, oh, well, you need to have this. And it's like, no, you just want people to work for you for free and for you to be able to make more money directly from them and from them recruiting more people. And you want to be able to have a guaranteed customer base. 320% in business over last year. Um, I know that uh, actually January of this year was the best month that the company has ever had in company history. More people joined the company in January than any month in the uh, company's um, career. We have the number three fastest growing female-led company. Interesting what he just said. So what constitutes the best month ever is more people joining, not more sales. Company's um, career. We have the number three fastest growing female-led company. Uh, Asma Isak is our CEO. She's been recognized multiple times by Forbes. So we really feel like we've got incredible leadership here as a company. Yes. So we have a proven model. Like I said, we have 4 million plus customers, 1 billion in global sales. I did it. I did it. I got there. Yay. Um, I put on lashes. <laughs> I had to take a little break. Okay. Just so much false information in it. Sometimes, sometimes you just got to take a breath. <laughs> But listen, I do it so you don't have to. 1 billion in global sales, over $750 million paid in commissions. Um, We have a 10 to 1 customer ratio and 85% of our revenue comes from customer volume. So that 10 to 1 customer ratio means that for each person that decides to be a social marketer, we average 10 customers. 
that is wild. You don't find that stat, like not even a fraction of that stat anywhere else in the industry. And the reason for that is our systems, the fact that these products work um, and the, the fact that people love them. So we do have winning systems. We have a simple launch system. So I yeah. referred to that 120 days worth of texts that are sent to you to help you with your social media. We have these built-in social selling tools. So we have a very supportive, uh, we have a very supportive community, world-class training. And then every Monday night, our team gets together and we do what we call family meeting where we connect, we talk, we share best practices, we train. Um, and it's just a really helpful time together as a team. Family meeting, that's culty. Wouldn't that just be called the town hall? That's what normal companies call it, or an all hands on deck. So you get to be in business for yourself, but you're definitely not by yourself. Um, so we also have a dual sided compensation plan. So you're going to get paid twice daily, meaning if you refer somebody to a product at night, you're going to get paid tomorrow morning. Um, we earn up to 36% on all of our customers. Um, you can earn income building a team and uh, you it says that you get paid twice daily. But not if you're make like not if you're not making sales though. So if you're not selling any products, you're not getting paid at all. It's just like with any other MLM, and they're like, we get paid five times a month. We get paid forty seven times a day. But not if you're not selling and not recruiting. That's not how that works. You're not going to be paid every minute of every day if you're not recruiting and not selling. I would much rather have guaranteed pay. Income building a team, and uh, you can also earn rank advancement bonuses as you continue to grow your business. God bless you. Excuse me. <laughs> so um, this is our customer pod commission, and don't let this overwhelm you. This is just a little bit of a peek as you continue to share products with other customers, how the compensation plan works. So as you can see, as you refer more people to these products, you're going to unlock greater commissions. And I don't know if you remember, but a little bit earlier, we talked about how we have a customer, a customer referral model, meaning that our customers are actually incentivized to go refer other customers. So what happens is when you bring somebody in as a customer, they get their own $10 off code that they can then go share with other customers. So you end up having your customers build your business for you. And as that continues to happen, you unlock those um, higher commissions. And then you'll also notice to the right, those live clean product credits. This is shopping credits for Modere. So as you continue to share these products with other people, you're also gonna be able to earn free products yourself. Yeah, yep. and then the team building side is where you can really leverage your business. And as you start growing a team, if you choose to do so, you can continue to rank advance and then the company pays you actually a monthly bonus for hitting ranks in the company. Yep. So that monthly team builder bonus is something that you can increase your income very quickly. Yes. Um, okay, so you wanna talk about the ways to get yeah, started? Yeah, so there's various ways to get started, but I love to just kind of highlight the best way to get started and it's our XM launch pack. It's $399, you get to choose from a couple of different options. You get more than $315 in products. In addition to that, they give you $200 in bonus shopping credits that you can use over the following four months. You get a free ticket to the upcoming training event. You can participate live or virtually. You're also eligible to earn the Modere experience, which I'll talk about on the next slide. And then you get 500 points towards your first achievement in the company, which is yes. really important. So I really believe that seeing this as a business, the XM launch pack is the best way to get started. The most expensive pack is the best way for you to join this company. <laughs> Or is it the best way for you to keep your rank? I can't stand when they say that shit. Like this more expensive one is the best way for you to grow your business and start your business. Why? Because there's more products in it and then I'll be able to talk about the products more. Is it gonna help me recruit people? No, it's not. Experience that we were referring to, when you come in with that XM collection, you have the ability to earn your Modere experience. So we wanna give you a- I feel like this is essentially the Mo neighborhood. Recruit a lot of people within a certain amount of time when you first join. And like, it's like a Kickstarter type of thing. And then you, like there's more incentives. Very achievable goal right from the beginning, help you get rewarded for your efforts. And that is the, um, the Modere experience. So. Basically, it means that you get five customers um, plus um, three XMs. So you're going to do a thousand points with customers and then you're going to enroll three XMs. And if you do that, you get your choice between an Apple Watch, a shopping spree, a weekend getaway or an iPad. And we have hundreds and hundreds of people on our team that earn this. Um, it's so doable and so rewarding when you get to earn these things. That doesn't make sense. So then what's the value of that? A weekend getaway it looks like it's like on an island or an iPad, an Apple Watch or a shopping spree. I feel like those things aren't equal to each other. I mean, I guess the shopping spree and the iPad and the watch could be depending on like what type of one you get, but then like a weekend getaway. I may, or maybe it's just like a $500 gift card or, or like a $600 one, maybe. Hey, so Madison, you've won at such high levels in this space and uh, you've been now with Modere for just a few short months. Would you share what your experience has been like so far? 
Yeah. So we were with another company for almost eight years, um, had a great experience, saw lots of success there. And, um, towards the end, we just weren't seeing other people, uh, winning on the same level that we were. And we just weren't seeing other people winning on the same level that we were. Let's translate that. That means that your downline was not making money or being able to recruit people or ranking up, meaning that you're not going to rank up. That's what that means. We weren't seeing people winning, which means that you're not making enough money there. We weren't seeing people winning. So you were all losing? You're losing or losing money? Okay. Deteriorate. We knew that obviously we could have stayed there and collected our check, but that just wasn't, we love the industry so much. And we love, um, we love helping people get to stay home with their families. And so we weren't done. We had more to do. And so we made the jump. Um, and it has been the most wild six months ever. We're seeing people who have never done network marketing in any capacity or sales or social media or anything like that have tremendous success. And it's really, really, really cool. It's fun. Like our fire is relit. Um, yeah. I mean, just the fact that you can be at home with kiddos without crazy overhead, without a specific degree, without going into debt. I mean, it's just a very unique type of business that you can start and um, be profitable and have fun with and enjoy and like get to help people and just link arms with people. So we love it. We're so happy at Modair. Um, like I said, it like has reignited our spark in such a big way. So we would love to have you guys. If you feel like this is for you, we'd love to have you guys jump in with us. That's awesome. Well, Madison, we're so thank proud of you Madison. and Sarah and Liza. Thanks for sharing. And for those of you yes. guys that joined us tonight, or perhaps you're watching the recording, man, like I've been in the industry for 15 years. And I feel like when we came here to Modair about a year ago, Modair just every day continued to exceed our expectations. And it just continued to surprise us with new innovations. And even coming up here in March, they're going to be launching what's called social retail next gen, where they're going to be taking our technology even to the next level. So we'll be able to serve our customers at a higher level. We'll be able to serve our teams at a higher level and we'll continue to pave the way for this, for this industry. Yeah, guys, we're literally weeks away from the biggest announcement since like the beginning of Modair. Um, and years ago when they launched social retail, it changed the game in network marketing, like nobody else. So they keep saying social retail changed the game. They launched social retail. Y'all just made up the word. <laughs> like that's it. Really the only thing that's different in Modair is that like the customer referral aspect of it where customers are getting more points or something or like getting $10 on their account if they like get someone else to use their code or something like since they have that aspect of it. Yeah, that's the only thing that's different about it, though. And that's really not enough for it to be like super revolutionary. I think my personal hell would me being in that type of environment and an MLM and not being able to escape it. Or being at a hardware store and not being able to find my way out. In network marketing, like nobody else is doing what Modair is doing and they're about to change the game again and just take it to a whole new level. So there truly is no better time to start in this business. So if this is something that resonates you. If this is something that resonates you, resonates with you. I say dumb shit all the time, so I'm no one to talk, but this is embarrassing. Team, um, get back with the person that invited you and thought highly enough of you to share this information with you. And we're just grateful that you spent tonight with us. So thanks so much, guys, and have a great night. Get with the person who thought so highly of you that they invited you to this opportunity call. No, if someone sends you an opportunity call, they don't think highly of you. They think of you as a dollar sign, and that's it. Knowingly or unknowingly, again, no matter what, if you are recruiting someone into an MLM, if you are in an MLM, you are being fucking manipulated and manipulating others as well. Please get out. Please know that these people are not your friends. They don't want the best for you. They want money and that's what it is. They want hope. They want a better life and they think that this is the only way to get it. It's not. It's just a vicious cycle and the industry itself, all of them are the same. It's not different. There might be a few words or bonuses or a little bit something different, but it's all about recruiting. That's what it is. That's how you're going to get to the top of the company and make all this money, but it's really not sustainable. To answer the question that I'm probably going to make the title of this video, is Moder a pyramid scheme? Yeah. This video could have been five seconds of me just saying, Yes, and then ending it. Can't do that. Please send me more of the recordings or, you know, access to the training calls or opportunity calls, anything like that. And I appreciate you for watching this video if you made it all the way through. I know it was really 
fudging long, hopefully. Me or Ethan will be able to make it shorter because I have a feeling it's gonna be real long and I hate that for me. Know how valuable you are. You are amazing. You are smart. You are worthy. Your feelings are valid. Stay spicy, stay assertive, work on those boundaries. It's okay to be selfish. And I hope you have a great rest of your whenever you're watching this. Okay, bye.